I commute like crazy. Brian Higby, along with his wife and young daughter, jumped on the Max Tuesday afternoon. They thought they were in store for an uneventful ride, but boy, were they wrong. It makes me sick to my stomach. Higby says his daughter was sitting in his wife's lap when all of a sudden she screamed out in pain. Turns around and she had a syringe sticking out of her pinky and had it in her hand. Higby says his little girl had been pricked by a needle that was wedged between the seats. It is just horrible. I don't know, uh, you know, Mine races instantly, you know, AIDS, hepatitis. The Higbys got off the max and made a beeline for the nearest doctor, who urged them to go to the hospital for testing. Those tests came back negative, but the little girl isn't out of the woods yet. There will be additional testing down the road. Today she's fine and she's smiling and laughing, but six months from now, I, you know, I could be losing her. Higby refuses to let his mind go there. Instead, he's focused on spreading awareness. I hope TriMet can up the game in, in the community as well. And we did hear from TriMet tonight. They're, of course, hoping the little girl will be okay as they investigate and review video of the incident. They're also saying this. Anyone may leave an item behind at any time, so we encourage all riders to check an area before they or their family members sit down. You better believe the Higby family will be doing just that. Back to you.